Hey, Mel! Man, what are you doing? Oh, hey, Tim, sorry, man. I was just getting ready. I'm going to Las Vegas tonight. What you got this ladder for? Uh, I was in the attic and, uh, you know, I'm ready to go, man. Ready to go? Come on, let's go. Well, just, you know, just rushing out of time. And... You're going to go like that? Which is, yeah, I'm going to ready to go, but wait, but wait, I just... You know more shoes. Huh? You know more shoes. Oh, shoes, yeah. No, no problem, bro. I got my slippers on. I'm ready to go. Okay, buddy? I'm ready to hit it. Let's go. Come on. Get the big time this time. I just moved here from another place, so... Don't mind the noise over here in the background. It's yeah, what is this noise anyway? Oh, man, you know, the neighbors, they, they make all kind of noise over there. They're pounding on everything. You know, it's crazy. I got this better car, so I'm ready to go over here. I'm ready to this car. I thought I'd make it be in Las Vegas. Lost my mind instead, lost my money, lost my head, lost control. And I worked all year like a dog for my big chance. But the money and my wallet, I left away from home. Put another nickel in, make a dollar. found this place. <laughs> no, 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 no. Just joking. I don't know if you know you're surrounded by local Hawaiians or something. Oh, you live in Hawaii? You look great, but nice big ears, everything. I like that. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw her ears, huh? Mm, me, I like the big ears, you know. He can fan you when he's hot, you know. <laughs> don't, don't get me wrong. I got big ears myself, but... Well, my, when, when mine was from, you know, when I used to pee in my pants when I was small, you know. Mother got tired changing my diaper, so one day she just hanged me on the clothesline. Go ahead, piss all you want. <laughs> this guy next to you, you know, he had no personality, though. He got three girls with him, you know, smiling. He's probably tired as hell, eh? He's Japanese, too, so he's gonna be real tired, you know. <laughs> so where you live, Kalua? Ooh. Mm. Leave by blowhole, eh? <laughs> Sorry, you look you look very nice. I was just looking at you. Don't mind me, I was I'm sorry. No, it's that's what happened when it, the thing get hard, it just Now you know why black guys cannot walk that good, eh? They want to get the big one, the blood leave the head, fill them up. <laughs> I'm sorry. We only get one black guy in here, so I'm not afraid. 
He is right there. He's hiding anyway, you know. Nah, I'm not scared of him. He only got one eye, I think. Of Sorry, buddy. I know it's a touchy subject, but it's true, right? <laughs> what the hell? You know, I only get one head. <laughs> so you're not married then, eh? Not engaged? Disease? <laughs> well, not is you gotta ask you every question, you know. You're not married, not engaged, something wrong with these brothers. Good looking ladies. What happened? You sex change? <laughs> Just joking. I don't even shake hands with people nowadays. No, that's the way you catch disease, shake hands. You think about it. You shake hands, you know, they shake hands the other guy, you dig his ear, dig his nose over. <laughs> And then shake hands with the other guy, the other guy dig his ears. <laughs> Ten years ago, I was shaking with bald headed person. <laughs> that sucker got hair now. <laughs> Let me check around the crowd, see what we get here. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> All right, couple virgins. <laughs> no, the guys. <laughs> it's good looking women here. Yeah. Las Vegas always get the nice looking ladies, you know. Me, I don't care for the nice looking one. Hey, you cannot trust them, you know. Not the, the, the ugly one, the best. You know, nobody else like them, you know. I'm serious. You get good looking girl, you send them store. You gotta watch your clock what time they come back. You get ugly girl, send them store. You don't care what time they come back. You hope they don't come back. That's alleviate a lot of pressure, you know. Talking to some girls that, from Costco here. Yeah. This is the one. You can get them all four of them for one pack. <laughs> it's Costco. You don't get buy one. You, know. you go over there buy four for one dollar. <laughs> all right, boy. Nice looking girls. Why, why, why am I not buddy? How you doing, girls? Fine. How's your hole? No, I mean family. <laughs> Got it. Probably this bug over here. How's it, brother? You thought I wasn't gonna bother you, eh? You thought I was fixed on the way anyway, yeah? <laughs> What you, Japanese? You Japanese? I know, but you Japanese or what? Don't get me wrong, I get Japanese girlfriend, all right? She mean bugger though, maybe your sister, I don't know. Eh? My girlfriend mean like her, she's bullet head like me, eh? She is, she's bald, I love her though. We drive down the road, put our heads together. Cop pulled me over one time. Hey, you driving upside down? <laughs> she don't ask. I'm sorry, I'm telling you guys the truth. Though. No, she mean like hell. She limp when she walk. She get that wooden leg. Eh? Every day I gotta screw her leg in, you know. So I said to her, Peg. You know, I've been screwing your leg five years now. <laughs> I figure I can screw out a leg or what? <laughs> Bugger just finally caught on, right? Huh? I was about five jokes away, bro. <laughs> Hit it, boys. All right, for my next song. This, this song goes out to my baby there. What's your name, hon? Julie, as in, <laughs> you know, Julie. It's all Filipino way, how you talk, Ju Julie. No, 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 I mean, jewelry. No, I can talk like that, I, I had much education. I was second grade, 11 years. Well, I couldn't go third grade, my father was third grade, you know. No look too good, you passed your father up. Eh? Hey, Julie, Julie, pay attention, what's wrong with you? If you see anything dripping down, don't say nothing, eh? Cause, no, I do have, you know, a problem, sinus. Once in a while, the damn thing come out, run down, the, put on my shirt, everybody just look at her. They don't say anything, they don't say what is that or whatever. You know, look like one snail when crawling your shirt. And don't just say nothing, you leave a white guy, you know, they, they get a lot of savage around there. What part do you leave? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
No, you don't give me the exact, you know. Just give me the location. Hurry up, because the camera coming on you now. And you're going to look like a dumb blonde if you don't answer fast. And who come here for you anyway? You know, if I had hair, I would treat the damn thing way better than that. Does birds ever try to land in there? Any Filipinos? Gee, only two, eh? Hello, man. Saba sakar na kita. We're lucky now because we get Filipino governor back home. Well, we have governor. So now we don't need to worry about electricity because gonna get plenty of flips, eh? We get Wilson Tunnel, Pali Tunnel, and Kaya Tunnel. <laughs> All right, no, so, so your tour is not going to catch on because you, you live over here. You live in the mainland, girls? Is that it? You live? Yeah. Where you live? Wamanalo? <laughs> or Waipaho? All right, you know the Filipinos then. They, they borrow your car once in a while? <laughs> I'm sorry. Filipinos, they don't have the nerve to take the car. They just take the tires. <laughs> I used to be Filipino. I quit. It's embarrassing to be Filipino. You gotta talk slow. <laughs> Brother! Where are you? <laughs> Going. <laughs> and then the other one say, I'm going to the... I forget. See, that's from worshiping chickens. You go in a Filipino house, they have chickens in their house. Teach the kids how to talk. I'm serious. I had chickens in my house when I grew up. You ever listen to chickens talk? No laugh. You talk like that too if you had a big egg coming out of your ass, you know. And you know, you kind of broke the egg, otherwise you end up as a dough boy. All right, look, I gotta open up. I can't fool around with you guys no more. Sorry, brothers, Filipinos. It is my pleasure to have you here do this bliss uh, because we are going to... Uh, we are going to win all the money. Then we are going to get the girlfriend. They're joking, brother. But there's two ways talking Filipino, fast and slow. I give you the slow way. The fast way, you know, you just jumble all the words together, you know. I like to go to the store with you, but I cannot go. I don't have no money. I like to go to the store with you, I cannot go. No, I don't have no money. <laughs> then you put the high part. I like to go to the store with you. I don't have no money. <laughs> no. All right, look, I got to open up now. <laughs> Get a hold of it. Jim, is that your wife there? Is that your wife? The girl with the red on? No, I, I just wondered because I know you bought two tickets and you told me it was with my... Is it? I don't want to. All right? Lucky buddy. The guy went school with me, but he look old, eh? So look at him. Bugger look old like him. Rough bugger boy in school. Yeah, every day he like fight with me, man. I just punch him and lay down. <laughs> nah, it's just the opposite. They freaking punch me on the head every time. No, that's not how I lost my hair, man. I used to wear a helmet there for school. Because I know in class he gonna punch my head every time. This is a mean guy, this guy, Portuguese guy. He get the space between his teeth. Big space. It's my chance for get this sucker back, you know. You try, look, look, you get the big space. I had a girlfriend like that with big space. Lie like hell. That's why he needs with big space. They lie through the teeth. <laughs> What's good though, because she no waste toothpaste, eh? And they put the toothbrush right inside there. No spill on the shirt, nothing, you know. And if you get time, bring me a drink. 
Yeah, shake them good, eh, baby? Hun. I like that girl. I think she liked me too, you know. You watch how she walk, one, one foot in front of the other. No, most of my girlfriends, they walk sideways, ladies. That's from eating crabs, eh? I know, I know, because I hang around the beach every day. I don't know if you know it, but I'm the guy that go down, you know, by Sandy Beach, where you, you live over there. Oh, man, can you just shut your ass? Said, how to shut? What? Why, you gay? <laughs> Sit on a chair or something. Well, I was talking, what I was talking about? Sandy Beach. So I don't know if you know it, but I'm the guy that, you know, poked the holes in the sand for the crabs. Some of you guys are laughing. Who, who you think poked the holes? Crabs. Not no more. They hire Filipinos. You know us Filipinos, we poke anything. And hey, my grandfather used to wake up four o'clock in the morning, wake for the crack of dawn. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. And you know, folks, if you feel like booing me, just boo me, because you paid, you know, you paid to come in here. So, you know, something going wrong, they yeah, boo, you fat shit, boo. You know? Boo me now, I don't care. Not you, you shut your ass over there. I don't trust that guy for nothing. I tell you the truth. All right, me and the boys, we're gonna open up. <laughs> I know you guys are waiting for me to sing. <laughs> I don't get sing. I just hold his damn thing, right? How's it, buddy? How you? Look at this guy's hair, man. Man, what a gift for you. Have some hair like this, but I wouldn't put him on my head, though. That kind of hair, you put him on your ass. Well, who's going to like that kind of white hair like that? I would dye that thing black, you know, buddy. This your wife next to you, buddy? She's good looking, buddy. You're lucky, but you don't deserve her. You know that. <laughs> that kind of girl should have, you know, a real man. <laughs> I'm not saying it's me, but you know. <laughs> where, where you from, buddy? You live Kalua, or something like that. You live here? What, what you, dealer? Stealer. <laughs> what kind then? I make hair. <laughs> you guys like that shit, eh? You got a couple monkeys. Anybody get gorilla milk? <laughs> okay, wait, wait. You come, my babe. How you doing, hon? You bought it for me? Damn, you're nice looking. What's your name, hon? What's your whole name? <laughs> Darlene Purge? Burge. Great, nice looking boy, huh? Call me later, right? <laughs> Call me after the show, all right, baby? I'll tell you my number now, 911. <laughs> if the police answer, go down there, wait for me. <laughs> Thanks for the beer. Boss bought me this, John. He keeps ass everything. <laughs> well, I'm doing this show for free anyway. Cause I lost all my money downstairs. I'm not making no bread. He getting no more back. That's why he pay me high. I get him 25 bucks for this show. I don't even know. And I'm not, I'm not even giving you guys the deluxe. <sighs> Thanks, hon. Is your mother behind you? She look really old. Is that your father? <laughs> oh, that's your sister and there's your whole family there. Yeah. All right, how's your dad? Hey, mom. Cool, this is the work I do, but <laughs> she get that new clothes on. You see them, the shoulder pads. That was invented by Portuguese, you know the shoulder pads? Portuguese invented that. Used to be padded bra, they put them on the wrong place. Eh? Now all the Howley's buying them. <laughs> Just joking, huh? It's 
nice big buckle you have there. So, are you winning any money? Yeah. yeah. You got a lot of personality, but I don't know why you're not married. I'm just trying to find out about this girl because someday, well, you know, I'm going to get me one like this. With hair and everything. But who sent you in here? Dilemma? No, everywhere I go, I, everywhere I go, I gotta get one like that, you know. Why you come here like that, anyway? You heard that? Very carefully. <laughs> Sorry, brother. What's your name? Del. You don't match Del, but you look, you look like a dick. No, doesn't he look like a dick? <laughs> How you doing, huh? You look different this time. <laughs> Gee, you must be the drinks. Mm -mm. I like that one. <sighs> Sorry, Julia. Don't get mad at me. But I'm kind of fickle. She's she going crazy for me. <laughs> Try to relax, son. You're lucky I never give you the old Filipino mating call. <laughs> this is before the other one, you know. The Coca-Cola can. <laughs> now they get the old one. Some of you guys all alone, you guys should try this sometime. Sitting next to a girl, you know? You're on a table next to them, dash out your chips and... They get mad, you go live in, you didn't hear you, you go live it louder, you know? They get mad, you make believe you're sleeping, that's all. This guy going crazy. He probably screw cows as well. Go, go. All right, yeah, I got a goat. That one is a porgy over there. You heard that, eh? Gotta be porgy. He said him twice. Go, go. Porgies always say, always say things twice. You ever talk to porgy? Hey, bro, where you going? Store, store. <laughs> Why? What, what, what you gonna buy? Bread, bread. I like go. No, no. <laughs> See, they do the one for each year. Porgy, you shine the light on one side. You go to the other side. You know, you can hear the words coming out. You can see the, the book going through, you know. All right, you guys All right, let's do, do, let's do this song together. Hit it, boys. You know, wait, my finger's not ready. I do have one right here. <laughs> okay, we're ready now. <laughs> no, it's a little small, I know, but just... <laughs> Hit it, boss! Hit it, boys! You're doing good! Well, me and my friends, we go out in the town. We can't sit still, we can't sit down. We don't like to fight, we don't like to scuffle. We dance all night to the curly shovel. Hey, mo, hey, mo, hey, mo. I said, yuck, 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 yuck. La da dee, la da cha. Chance. We got up and danced in the curly shovel. Well, me and my friends, we love Larry and Mo. We love Larry's brother Sham and his fat clone Joe. Well, it just so happens those knuckleheads get in the scuffle. They dance so not to the curly shovel. Hey Mo, hey Mo, hey Mo. I said, yuck, 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 yuck. yuck, 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 yuck. La -da -dee. <laughs> it's 
man, I never eat your bone today. <laughs> well, we never get a chance. We got up and danced to the curly shovel. We're doing the curly shovel. Curly shovel, what's going on? Huh? The curly shovel. Curly shovel. Jazz, you know. Well, we never take a chance. We got up and danced to the curly shovel. Thanks, friends. Hey. All right. What an exciting night this is turning out to be. <laughs> Don't worry, honey. I'm not going to pick on you, all right? Did you guys been married for a long time? Well, he said too. She said too long. How long have you been married? <laughs> 24 years? <laughs> So you have any kids? Four. <laughs> nah, nobody really cares, you know. I don't care if you get married 20, 30 years. Only you know how serious it is, right, buddy? I mean, you know how bad and bad it is to be married that long to the same person. <laughs> Every day smelling his farts, everything else, you know what I mean? <laughs> wow. Did I say something wrong? <laughs> Everybody fought. <laughs> no, I mean, not right now, but... <laughs> God invented the farts. Then he put a smell in it so the deaf can enjoy it. <laughs> Next year, I don't have to do this shit no more. I'm gonna be in the movies. I already did one movie, it was, it was a low budget, you know. It was a porno film, you know. I knew it was low budget because I was the only actor in there. I freaking directed it. was a training film for Marines, you know. How to enjoy yourself in the foxhole. It was surrounded by the enemy. Enemy coming, you coming too. Enemy shoot, you shoot him back. <laughs> so there I was, you know, I was going for him. <laughs> oh, yeah. Freaking director said, cut! <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm, not, I'm not finished yet. <laughs> how are you girls? All right, you look great, girls. Keep it up, all right? You guys going on the table? Hey! Hang on, I gotta give you a sign language. <laughs> I just ask them if they're gonna gamble. Don't laugh. One of them said, yeah. <laughs> Frank, you hungry? <laughs> no, I'm just asking me hungry shit, you know. I'm not going to tell him put him on his hot dog. I got to blow my nose. I'm sorry. I get, every time the light comes, the thing shine on the head. And, no, that thing make you sinus, you know, drip. Because I get the solar panel, eh? I'm on a ground. Filipino guy pick him up tomorrow. <laughs> my father. <laughs> yeah. My father, nice guy though. He don't say too much. Why well, he speak Filipino? He's shame, eh? Okay, we, we all speak English in the house. Me and my dog, my cat. <laughs> I got a weird dog too, but he don't talk much. He, he no more teeth, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you like one more punch? Small bugger, you know. Well, last week it was in heat, eh? 
And then the other dog, what the other, actually, my dog knew was in heat, was the other one next door. You know, the small one, Fifi. <laughs> and my dog, <laughs> Oh, he like over there, go, go, go poke him, eh? He says, shut up, I can't go take you to the neighbor's house. Just quiet down, you want some soup? Well, you know you can eat bone, eh? <laughs> now, how I found him, he, he was shitting in my yard. I knew it was him. Because most dogs, you know, they make a doodle in your yard, they make the crisscross or something like that. But this one, he was making cinnamon roll, you know. I think go to this, you know. That. A big shit, about this big, you know. Freaking neighbors got all pissed off at me. Well, he got loose, he got shit in the other neighbor's yard. They call, hey, Malcolm Ben, growing shit in his yard. Cop came over, think it was dope, eh? I broke one piece here, officer. Smoke one. <laughs> you can't tell that, Frank. I like you, buddy. Which one is your favorite wine over there? Uh, you like all of them? Come on, brother. Don't give me this shit. Just tell me. Tell me the truth. Which one you really like? Which one is the best, buddy? <laughs> See, the other one got pissed off when you say that. <laughs> but you like the one in the purple? Someone I would choose to, buddy. You know. Huh. I saw your friends. And what, you poke your friends? I'm <laughs> oh, sorry, Frank. I'm gonna sing. All right, like me and the boys, we like open up now. <laughs> Let's sing the song, you know, for you guys. Hardy and the gang. The Portuguese is two wainis. The flip will quit. And Frank and his three musketeers. <laughs> Frank, why don't get the kind? You know, nowadays you can get good on for a different price, you know. <laughs> Let your fingers do the walking, you know. You can talk to the yellow page. You catch on what I mean? So this guy went, doctor. You see the doctor, he said, hey, doc, I don't know what it is, but my dick all yellow. <laughs> oh, the thing all orange, everything. So let me take a look. Holy <laughs> man! What the hell are you doing, brother? She said, you, 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 the thing always yellow? Said, yeah, yeah, I don't know, man. The thing just turned yellow. I don't know what that is. Holy shit. What, what you doing with that? I mean, your whole family are ladies? She said, no, just me. I don't know. Why. Well, what you do? What's your activity? I don't know. I just stay home, watch TV, and eat Cheetos. <laughs> That's my brother's joke. What the hell are you doing? I said I'm wrong, you know why? His dick was orange. <laughs> no, he just told me now, it was orange, bro. So this black guy was in the bathroom taking a piss, you know. <laughs> Freaking midget came stand by him, you know. Black guy turned to me, hey, I'm six feet four, 250 pounds, 13 inch dick. My name Ben Brown. The guy fall down in faint. <laughs> guy pick him up. What's wrong with you, man? <laughs> Can you repeat that again? <laughs> I'm six feet four, 250 pounds, 13 inch dick. My name Ben Brown. Oh, talk, thank God. I thought you said Ben Down. <laughs> so that's the kind of jokes you guys like, huh? All right, look, me and the boys, <laughs> me and the boys, we're gonna open up. We're gonna fool around with you guys forever. Because we do have the mayor of Kauai here tonight. The Filipino guy right here. Why well, he thinking of becoming a mayor, man? This is probably the richest guy in, in Kauai. No, she hold all the land. Serious. You go Kauai, you gotta talk to him. We'll park your car. But you gotta talk Filipino. Brother, I like to pak pak pak. Tak tak me, tak tak bang kata. Park my car. 
You know how Filipinos talk to figures. I don't know what the hell they do. Where they learn that shit, you know? You can sound like one of them engines sputtering, you know? You get a mad, they talk fast. <laughs> Freaking tables is waiting for me, man. I'm gonna rape them out there tonight. Tonight is the night, but I feel it in my bone. I'm serious. This is the one that tell me if I can gamble or not. My flag is up. <laughs> you ever heard that joke? I don't know if I can remember that thing. Good afternoon, sports fans, and welcome to the Kentucky Derby here at beautiful Churchill Downs. Our regular announcer is ill today, but we'll be calling on Tricky Lopez to say a few words. Tricky, come on out, say a few words to our listening audience. Uh, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the cunt, 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 Kentucky d -d 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 Derby. Thank you very much, Tricky. Don't call us, we'll call you. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, today's featured race is the mi out of mile and a quarter. It's the $200,000 Ida Stakes race with a field of six. Headed by that very quick gilding, my dick. <laughs> Ridden by two balls high. <laughs> the other entrants in the field are as follows. Good head from the pleasure stables <laughs> with jockey Roger Forskin. You're a pussy from the Twin Lakes tables <laughs> with jockey I itch. <laughs> Sweet lips from the candy cane tables with jockey Will Quiver. <laughs> and no, not tonight, from the tomorrow tables <laughs> with jockey Don't Touch Me Here. <laughs> and finally, your ass from the Blowhole tables <laughs> with jockey Die Aria. Uh, excuse me, D Aria. Horses are approaching the starting gate. There seems to be some action down there. Uh, folks, your ass is rearing up in the gate. <laughs> folks, the stewards have decided to scratch your ass. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, get out a pencil and scratch your ass. <laughs> the flag is up. And there they go, into the first turn is good head by neck, <laughs> your pussy by leg, <laughs> no not tonight, and my dick trails you. <laughs> into the far stretches, your pussy by leg, <laughs> excuse me, by two legs, <laughs> she's opening her stride. <laughs> Your pussy, and here comes my dick. <laughs> and to the far stretch and turning for home, it's my dick and your pussy. <laughs> my dick, your pussy. Oh. They're head in head. <laughs> my dick, your pussy, my dick. And the winner is... <laughs> no, not tonight. <laughs> I don't know who was going to win the race. Oh, shit. <laughs> shit. Now you guys clap. I wrote that damn thing in 1978. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to get married, though. So, one of you goes... My girlfriend, no way, she don't get it. Honey! <laughs> she don't get in here, I'm serious. You just look at her. She look normal, everything, but that's why I pick her. <laughs> so I can bring them, you know, show like this, and she don't get this shit, you know. Honey! <laughs> Goldie, you ready, baby? Goldie over there, he's ready to go. You know the cue, you know. <laughs> Goli, what do you think about this Waini? Would you change your ways for this one? Huh? You gotta quit being a queer already. You know, <laughs> I'm serious. Get to with the world, buddy. Get with the world. God gave you a dick for, you know, plug up holes. <laughs> oh, 
I'm serious. You know, that guy's a queer, you know, shit. I love him. He's my friend, you know. I mean, because he's a queer, I gotta quit being a friend of his. Coley, you all right? All right, baby. <laughs> you know, queer is just sensitive. I don't like hurt his feelings. <laughs> you all right, baby? All right, tonight I'll let you touch me, all right? Just on my feet, just on my feet, okay? Maybe next week you can go about my ankle. <laughs> open up now. As you notice, I'm putting the guitar down. On your head pretty soon. Down on your head. <laughs> just checking. Everyone, once in a while, I tie them up. Once in a while, I drop down. No, I don't want the damn thing drop down. And this lady been married 24 years and she started looking over there, you know. Sorry, buddy, okay? I don't mean that, you know that. But you see anything, the thing drop down, step in front of your wife, because... No, they get nervous, you know what I mean? <laughs> Julie, you all right? <sighs> yeah, nowadays you hear reading the paper, this all these battered women, I was reading in the paper. 200,000 women in the United States get battered every year. Did you know that, Julie? You did? See, I didn't know that because I've been eating them raw all this time. <laughs> <laughs> One of these days, I'm gonna be a big Italian star. I wake up in the morning, eat the breakfast. As I wait, bring me two pieces of toast. She only bring me one piece. I said, wait, bring me two pieces. Wait, I want a two pieces. <laughs> she only bring me one piece. She say, hey, you want a two piece? You go to the toilet. <laughs> no, waitress, you don't understand. I want a two piece on the plate. <laughs> you better no piece on the plate, you son of a gun. I go to another restaurant, eat a lunch. I say, they only bring me the knife, no more fork. I say, wait, I want a fork. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure, everybody want a fork. <laughs> you don't understand, wait, I want a fork on the table. <laughs> you know better fork on the table, son of a bitch. I punch in your head. <laughs> I go to another. I go back to my hotel room, lay down in the bed, take a nap. No more the sheet. I call the manager. Manager, I want a sheet. <laughs> you want a sheet? You go to the toilet. <laughs> you don't understand, manager. I want a sheet on the bed. <laughs> you better not sheet on the bed, you son of a gun. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you okay? Is that you talking? You never even move your lips, nothing, brother. Made your voice come right out of this guy's ass away. All right, look, we'll sing another song, try to thrill you guys, all right? This goes for all the beautiful girls here. Well, they're not all here yet, but it goes for the ugly girls. You know who you are. I'm not going to point. They're all in one area. <laughs> you guys see them yet? <laughs> open up, honey. Let's open up, Colin. Let's do a song for these guys. Thrill is. Because some of these people never... Hit it, boys! I remember the night we met Twice Was a night I won't soon forget You and me beneath the mango tree And me in my puka BVDs How I hated to say goodbye 
But at two of us you had to try We made love just you and me I was wearing my puka bibi I remember that November You were tender and held me tight And no more patches or needle and thread So maybe I should have worn my love a love instead Now I wait for you by The shore So I won't be alone no more With the stars and the moon and the sea We'll make love in my book of BVD Hit it boys! At the dance, you gave a glance I saw my chance to hold you tight We did the mambo like we were 60 And then my book of BBDs came apart of the seams Now I wait for you by the show So I won't be alone no more the stars and the moon and the sea I'll be wearing my Puka BVD My Puka BVD My Puka BVD And you're just wondering why I was, you know, dancing the step on, the side step, while my cellular phone is in there. <laughs> I have a real small cellular phone. I keep mine in the back. Wait, when it rings, it goes, boop. <laughs> I just wanted a whole bunch of calls come in one time. <laughs> and I'm bored over there, you know what I mean? <laughs> what are we going to do after this? Gamble. Well, we never, no, we'll gamble, eh? No gamble, buddy. You're already gambling with your life now. Well, <laughs> guys, you know, how do you guys want to go? So, my Hawaiians don't can make it because one guy like that, you know. Well, Hanukkah is. You think this is it? Should I go back home? There's a whole bunch of them like that. Next you know, I'm with my sister. Oh my God. No, no, I, she's still outside, bro. Go. <laughs> the next drink, what we gotta, we gotta get the next drink for brother over here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You got a drink, double, triple, anything you want, anything. You hear me? I put him on this Japanese tab. You're lucky, honey. If you get me, boy, you'd be really lucky. You get two faces. <laughs> one on top, one on the side. Yeah. This is good. You get two. When you're bald, you confuse the Samoans. <laughs> is that going to punch your eye? Okay, shoot. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Good friend of mine, Samoan guy, used to fall off the bed all the time. His name was fell off a sofa. So one day, you know, fell off a set, fell off a sofa. <laughs> fell off a sofa, he's gonna park his car down by food lane. Eh? That's how we move. So the uh, security guard said, You cannot park here, it's for come back car. Yeah, I'm gonna go in, come back later. <laughs> Sorry, Jimmy. You might have noticed I gave a burp. Yeah. Unlike burp, because when you burp, you cheat your ass out of a fart. Yeah, I'm sure, you know, you go down there and gamble, everybody all mingling, they don't know if you fought it or not, you know. <laughs> you go over there, you make one rap on you, know. But a gambling and you look. <laughs> what is the best part is when you're losing. 
And when you're losing, you're on the crap table, go over there and you get some gas in your front, right? The dealers, they cannot move, you know. <laughs> well, they gotta stand right there, they cannot move, they gotta... <laughs> they cannot touch their nose, their hands, their face, nothing. They cannot touch anything. <laughs> you see some of them doing purple, they try to hold right like there. No, I, I did it a couple of times. <laughs> no, I, no I'm, I've been there. I have been there with somebody with land on fast one, you know. And you're standing over there and you're freaking de dealing. <laughs> and you know how they usually do it. They gotta clap their hand. And how they make their hand, you know. Ta -ta, whatever. Right? <laughs> to show that they don't have no chips in their hand. It's freaking, I know he like slap his hand. <laughs> I've been joking with all you guys, but my girlfriend over here sitting down. She's good looking, but she doesn't say much. Well, she cannot talk. Because she cannot hear you either, so what the hell? No, she, she's deaf and dumb. Honey. Honey. No, she knows that part only. No, if I talk, she won't understand anyway, so I just gotta make her language. Honey! <laughs> she said, if I bother her, she gonna kick my ass. <laughs> huh? <laughs> no. She told me already, plenty of times I'm number one, you know. you number one! <laughs> Alright, look, I gotta go. Because I go down today, tomorrow I go to Lake Mead. I go down there and poke some holes in the sand. <laughs> I'm going to try because I heard you get gravel in there. <laughs> Let's see how strong Junior is. <laughs> Alright? So you're going to see me 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to be down there at Lake Mead. You see all the holes in there? That's me. Okay? <sighs> Julie, go down there, go lay down, wait for me. <laughs> she looking here, don't worry about that, okay? I'm serious, she can hear shit. Okay? Do it. Who's the father looking at me? Don't worry about it, I'm not eating to her, baby. She's too handsome for me, alright, buddy? My girlfriend, just right. Not that good looking. <laughs> Not that classy. <laughs> no can talk, no can hear. <laughs> blind and deaf. It's a problem. He said blind and deaf. This is the only sequence he was listening to. You realize that? <laughs> okay, look. You gotta drive safely if you go drive, right? Because, you know... The other day I was down Waikiki, some suckers was driving on the sidewalk, drunk like hell. No even have car, nothing. <laughs> the worst the bugger was in reverse, you know. I say, bro, where are you going? She figure. I cannot, I cannot. <laughs> okay, bro, wait for me, eh? Go to take a break and then I'll come back, okay? <laughs> she said, don't worry, but no matter how long you take, you can wait for me. <laughs> but thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you guys later. Go enjoy yourself. Thank you. Look at this smile, crowd. Thank you, brother. You've been the best. That big old eye, I wish you were the moment. I'd like to take that big old eye.